Hey guys, hey, how are you guys a durian? Is you guys a durian? Cause I finally went to the commissary, commissary. So we haven't gone to the commissary since we went to Sam's Club at the beginning of the month. So we haven't had really any accoutrements to like make food with. Um, this might be today's video. Uh, today is the sixth. I also have a sit down video that I need to do. I have a bunch of videos that are kind of in, like so I have an everyday video for at least a little while. Um, let's try to keep that going, you know what I'm saying? So this is my $260 haul from the commissary. So first things first is white vinegar. We use this on um, her clothing because a lot of times it comes back smelling like grease. And if you put a little bit of vinegar in with, um, with your clothes soap, it'll help kind of break up that smell and some of that grease. Right, I'm just gonna start with random bag. So I bought a bunch of uh, Brussels sprouts and broccoli. So these all go in my, my freezer. So I will be putting stuff away as I talk. I don't have my headset on because um, you guys said that my you said that my mouth wasn't moving with the um, with the thing, so it was aggravating. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, some days I will, you know, do it. Some days I won't. This is more just broccoli and Brussels sprouts. So. Like I said, I bought a lot. Um, one thing of Brussels sprouts is a meal for me. Um, one thing of broccoli for her is two meals, like two parts of a meal. I'll eat this entire thing, like for a, for a meal. So, yeah. I'm real happy today. Today's a good day. Um, bought one of those hams that I like so it's just deli ham um, but it's you know a spiral ham it was 18.52 this is hella meal for us so I'm super I'm super stoked about that um, I'm making chicken tacos tonight so I need to break up some this chicken here. Hold on. So, so I'm going to be using what's left of the rotisserie chicken and then two of these um, four chicken tacos tonight that will last a few days. I need to put this back in the fridge. Okay. There's a lot. 260 buys a lot. Uh, what's in here? Okay, so Evelyn does not sleep well, so she takes z to sleep. I told you guys that we bought those uh, Luna pills off of Amazon. They're garbage. Like, they're absolute trash. They don't work for her. We tried straight melatonin. We tried melatonin gummies. We tried melatonin with all kinds of HTHC5, some shit like that. It, if you, We've tried it. It don't work. So I bought her two of those. I bought my sriracha. Um, I bought some more. I never have enough tomato sauce. I bought uh, kidney beans for chili. And I bought my favorite. This one's my favorite. This one is the teriyaki marinade sauce. This one has uh, with all the sesame seeds. That's my freaking favorite. I also bought two things of pastaroni. I bought 
one thing of all rotten right potatoes. These are these are treats. So she's not allowed to have these until her PT test, which is on the 19th. But those are there for her when she is done. I bought um, vanilla extract. I bought um, some golden raisins. I love golden raisins. I love golden raisins. So I bought those. Um, I bought some Serrano chilies to go in our chili. I bought some avocado, obviously for chili. I bought some mushrooms for, um, I'm gonna put these in the freezer. Um, I bought mushrooms. Actually, I'm gonna put them in a bag and then in the freezer, so give me a minute on that. Um, for stroganoff, I bought carrots. Um, I didn't buy any hummus, but these are just for her. Right now, my teeth aren't having it. Hey, what's in this bag? I think these are just nanners. So I bought her some nanners. Uh, bananas don't really typically do very well with my stomach, but I eat them anyway because who doesn't like a nanner? Who don't like a nanner? Okay, so I bought a big ass five pound bag or ten pound. This might be this is a fifteen pound bag of rice that will last us the rest of this year, probably. So this is um, sushi rice, sushi grade rice. Uh, we love it. Um, you have to wash it yourself so you don't get the luxury of having it washed for you. But this is our favorite rice. Okay. You're going to kind of start seeing my obsession with food. Um, I don't buy just one pack of tuna fish. I buy 14 packs of tuna fish. And then I mix it with... Uh, nori and a little bit of mayonnaise and sometimes i put sushi rice with it um but yeah you'll start seeing things like that uh this is for stroganoff for her so uh no yolk egg noodles i bought some um paper towels because i can never not have paper towels um I bought some a 60 pack of the clothes stuff for us because we were running out. I bought some interesting shit. Um, I bought some crushed strawberry. I only bought two of them because that's all they had. Um, normally I would buy like every box they had. Look at that. Um, they only had this many, but I'm gonna see if I can't get her to swing by Walmart so I can get the ones that I like. In one video, I show you guys what I drink and like how I make my drinks, so you'll see that I, I take one of these. Okay, so I wanted to try something different to bake, so it's fish and chicken mix, um, just to see if we would like it, so you could put it in the oven. Um, so I thought maybe we'd try that one night. I got some squeezed cilantro. I got her a treat. That's a treat. Um, I got chili mix. I got lime mojito mix. Um, I got her some Ovaltine. I know, who the hell drinks Ovaltine? She does. Um, I got two things of um, my True Lemon because I drink that with my waters every day, every single day. So I did have a dustpan. I finally bought a damn dustpan. Um, lived here a year, never bought a dustpan. Um, bought our shampoo and conditioner and bought some diodorant. So that stuff can go upstairs. Um, I bought some TMI, but I bought some pads. I also bought some baby wipes. So that's what I use. I don't particularly like toilet paper because it doesn't get you clean. It doesn't. Um, this gets you 100% clean. Why do you think you put them on babies? Why do you say it's all? Why do you wipe a baby's ass to keep it clean? Why wouldn't you do it yourself? You don't ask. Like, since, think about it, you wipe baby's asses for like how many years? And then with just wipes to make sure their asses are clean, yet you don't wipe your own. This is hamburger. Putting it up in the freezer. 
I don't know, I'm strange, but you guys already knew that. Uh, I got our yogurts. So I got uh, key lime, which is the one I like. I got her um, the Faye 5%, and I put honey in this for her for her breakfasts. So I got like eight of these yogurts for me. So those are kind of like grab and go um, breakfasts. Breakfast, breakfast, Nirvana, the word is breakfast. Breakfast. Okay, I got garlic because I was almost out. I got mayonnaise because I was out. I got, ah, I got shit falling on the floor. I got our chipotle peppers for our um, chili. I got two cans of Spam um, for Masubi. I got another can of tomato sauce. One loaf of bread that I'm going to put in the, um, uh, occasionally I will make her um, French bread. I like this bread, so what I do is I just put it in the fridge or the freezer and I leave it there till I need it. So this is going to go in the freezer because I don't need it for a while. I don't need you for a while. Um, let's see what else. What are this? Oh, I got her some really nice tomatoes. So these are Constellation tomatoes. So I got her two things of that. So that's what she'll be eating. Um, so I'll make kind of like a little salad type thing. I think I'm pretty much done, guys. Um, just this bag of produce. So flat leaf parsley. Um, I got two things of baby um, cucumbers for her. I got um, some salad mix for her. And then a big bag of onions. And that's it. That's all. Because I already showed you the pads, I already showed you the shampoo and conditioner, and then that's it. So, no trash, no garbage, in my opinion. I didn't buy candy chips, pies, cookies. Um, I tried to buy as, as well as we could. So, if nobody told you today that you're amazing, let me be the first person to do so. You are amazing. You are beautiful, you are kind, and you are compassionate. And I appreciate you taking the time out of your day to be here. I appreciate you watching my videos. I appreciate and then I appreciate you when you comment. I appreciate you when you don't comment. I appreciate you just in general just for taking time out of your day to spend a little bit of it with me. If nobody told you today that they are proud of you, I am so proud of you. It doesn't matter if all you've been able to do today is just exist. If that's all you're able to do today, I'm still so proud of you and so thankful to know that you're still here. If nobody told you that you would be missed and that you are needed and wanted, I would miss you. I need you and I want you here. I appreciate you for being just who you are, just as you are. So I love your beautiful, gorgeous, amazing faces. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day no matter where you happen to be in the world. And I will talk to you very, very, very soon. Bye.